How you doing gents? Uh, it's been a long time since I've made a shaving video. Um, mainly because I didn't buy any new uh, razors and stuff. Um, I've got enough to keep me going for a long time. Um, but I decided that I've been growing, not intentionally, but I haven't shaved for a couple of weeks and I've got this big thick beard. And uh, I thought I'd give the uh, Mool R41. This is one from uh, 2011. I thought I'd give it a test on um, seeing how it does on uh, thick growth like this. As you can see, it's pretty full on. Um, anytime I've had growth like this, going back when I used multi blade carts, I'd be forever trying to shave it because uh, the multi blade carts clog, and if you go the opposite way against the grain, it pinches and tears the face off you. So, uh, we're going to test the um, Mool R41, which is uh, the most aggressive um, open comb double edge razor. And uh, they've revised this, I think, last year, and they've brought the cap out by a mill or two on each side. This is the original one, this is the most aggressive one. Um, I've never shaved, I haven't even had a beard like this for a long time since I started the issue. So uh, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put the uh, Mule R41 to the test and see how it does. Uh, I've just taken a shower and the uh, beard is soft and I'm going to uh, lather up with some um, Parasso Raid. This is the heaviest growth I've had for a long time. The weather's been pretty cold and I've been doing stuff outdoors. So, um, I decided today it's going. And uh, I couldn't resist the opportunity to um, share this with you. Okay, so start off. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Better than I actually thought. No clogging. I mean, it, this is a, technically an open comb razor, but there's actually no comb. It's just a type of a grid. My God. Just mowing it down. I might add, I'm actually using a brand new feather blade. And um, those of you in the know, those of you who are actually into uh, PE shaving, will know that feather. It's regarded as probably one of the best blades of all time. That's why they're known as Fierce and Feather. Japanese ninja blade. This is unbelievable. It's worth growing a beard just to do this. Munches it off like a hungry horse.
<laughs> I'm almost clean shaven. Now, just going to change out the water and get rid of all the. Uh, here. Second pass, and I'm going to do uh, a little stash in the second pass. It's the hardest. The hardest stuff on my face. Mama! Just more done.
glue it back down. A little bit of uh, alum. Pat your face dry. I usually use um, Parasso. This one is a, a beauty. Uh, feels really good and smells great. So there, I'm done. And uh, usually I top it off with a um, little splash of uh, fluid, which is uh, Spanish aftershave. And you can, it's fluid is mild, so you can show on some of your um, favorite clone after that. So there I am, I finished. Uh, the Mool R41 is um, definitely the meanest razor on the block and um, I can't believe how easy this was. Just absolutely, just a walk in the park. So uh, until next time, uh, I, might do, I might grow a beard again for another couple of weeks and uh, do a fat tip razor on it, see what happens. Uh, take care.